Hi, Regina here, and welcome back to Stem Cell Talks. As many of our viewers already know, our last three videos have been dedicated to clinical trials involving dental pulp stem cells, also known as DPSCs. Well, today we want to share with you another exciting and innovative use of DPSCs, treating type 1 diabetes. Type 1 diabetes is a chronic condition that results from the immune system attacking pancreatic beta cells, preventing the pancreas from producing insulin. There are currently 1.6 million people in the United States afflicted with this condition, and the number is expected to rise to 5 million by 2050. DPSCs, which fall into the category of mesenchymal stem cells, have the ability to differentiate into insulin-producing beta cells, while also possessing immune modulation capabilities. Researchers at Shanghai Hospital in China, looking to take advantage of the unique properties inherent in DPSCs, are conducting a phase one clinical trial to assess their safety and efficacy as a treatment option for type one diabetes. The clinical trial will involve 24 patients with type one diabetes who will receive infusions of DPSCs at enrollment, two weeks after enrollment, and six weeks after enrollment. The primary objective of the treatment is to minimize the need for supplemental insulin. Thus, the efficacy of the treatment will be evaluated by tracking changes in necessary daily insulin doses. This trial represents the leading edge of potential DPSC therapies as the research migrates from the lab to clinical trials. We will continue to update you on the status of this trial and others involving dental pulp stem cells. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like us and to subscribe, and we'll see you again soon.